Le président, veuillez vous asseoir. L'audience est ouverte. For this morning's schedule, we have we will have two separate hearings. Nous allons tenir aujourd'hui deux audiences the distinctes. The first is to hear the opinion of the doctor. Ce matin, who has been treating Yingsari? Le médecin who was qui soigne Yingsari, qui a été hospitalisé du 17 au 22 mai 2012. It is in relation to the health condition of this particular accused, as whether he is able to participate in the proceeding and the state of health of the accused under two days during this week. And after that, we shall hear the testimony of the witness T C W four eight seven. Nous aurons l'audience pour entendre la déposition du who was summoned CCW to testify since Monday, but he could not provide his testimony lundi. due to the health condition of the accused in Sari. In reason of the absence of the accused in Sari. Also, the chamber would like to clarify that for this later hearing of this witness, l'audience. Sur la déposition du Depending témoin TCW 487, doctor, that if the opinion is positive, meaning that if Yingsari is held, dans l'éventualité où does not le médecin from participating est d'avis que l'état de santé de Yingsari ne l'empêche pas de participer à l'audience des deux prochains jours, le témoin TCW 487 comparaîtra. If the opinion of the doctor, of the treating doctor, is one that Yingsari cannot participate, then the chamber will decide accordingly. Participate to the audience. The chamber will take the decision that is imposed. Gravier, could you report the attendance of the parties to the proceeding? Faire rapport sur la présence des parties. Le greffier. Mr. President, all parties to the case are present except the présentes. accused Ian Sari, who is now resting at the detention facility awaiting the instruction Ying from the Sari chamber. Est au centre de détention the doctor who has been invited by the chamber is present le and he is waiting in the waiting room. Et dans la salle d'attente. The witness TCW487 is present, est présent lui aussi, awaiting to be called by the chamber. Et attend d'être appelé par la chambre. Je vous remercie, Monsieur le Président. President, thank you, Mr. Le Président. Merci, Monsieur le Greffier. In Sarah's defense, do you have any? La défense de Yingsari a été demandée par rapport à cette première audience. Est-ce que c'est en relation à la santé condition de l'accusé qui est votre client Vous avez la parole si vous le souhaitez. Bonjour, Monsieur le Président. Bonjour, Mesdames et Messieurs. Bonjour à tous et à toutes dans la salle de la courte. Cette matinée, nous avons assisté à une audience de témoins qui ont été présentés par le juge et tous ceux et celles aux alentours. Cette matinée, nous avons assisté à une audience de témoins qui ont été Mr. Ying Sari, we had an approximately 15-minute conversation during which time we had asked him about his health and also discussed again about these particular proceedings. He has indicated the following. One, 
He waived his presence during these parts of the proceedings, that is, when his medical status is being discussed. Uh, two, he has no objections uh, to his medical status being discussed in, public, in, public, in public a public hearing. De hearing. De santé. Uh, three, Troisième he does point. not, and I underscore, does not Je waive his presence for the following Il two witnesses. Uh, that are scheduled because both touch upon des deux témoins. Uh, him Ce sont deux témoins uh, either directly or indirectly or go into uh, des faits qui sur lui, acts indirectement. and conducts which are alleged against him in the uh, closing order. Uh, dans de he à son uh, does uh, and is, is willing to waive his presence to Il other witnesses which may not uh, directly touch upon him pour des témoins. Uh, since he does not wish to hold, uh, hold up the proceedings. Uh, we uh, are in the process of finalizing a limited waiver Nous so that all of this can be, uh, be uh, provided to your honors in writing with his signature. Qui vous sera remis pour as, uh, as far as his medical condition is concerned, and we're not, I'm not a medical doctor a myself, you know, santé, uh, nor do I pretend to be one, Je ne suis pas but, médecin, je ne uh, pas l'être non plus. He's, he informed us, and I, I would et tend to value his, uh, his assertions, that et je respecte more than five minutes or so, uh, he begins to feel dizziness. Après cinq minutes, and il so he's unable to vertiges. physically be here. Et donc, and as far as mentally is concerned, he's indicated to us that he doesn't feel beyond a five-minute time span, he's able to concentrate without getting busy. Uh, it is his particular request uh, that there be no uh, proceedings, at least if these are the two witnesses that are scheduled, for the remainder of the week. Were the trial chamber to call upon other witnesses, si that would be something else, témoins, uh, depending on who they may, may be, if they don't touch upon him then certainly he is willing to waive. But it is his request that at least today and perhaps tomorrow uh, uh, that he definitely not even come to the court. Uh, he does wish to be present for the following witness, especially for the following witness, given the witness's uh, position and, uh, and what is expected to be the line of questioning from, from the various parties. So parties that's my status uh, report to the trial chamber. Voilà mon rapport à la chambre de première and instance. If, there any, if there are any questions, then I'll Si vous avez des questions, je peux bien sûr y répondre. President, thank you. The prosecution, you may proceed. La parole est au bureau des procureurs. Thank you, Mr. President. Le procureur. Um, I won't, uh, uh, respond that now uh, regarding the medical conditions. We'll wait to hear uh, from the doctors. Uh, I just wanted to uh, clarify one matter. Um, uh, Mr. Carnivus referred to uh, his client not being willing to waive for the next two witnesses. Uh, obviously, we understand that one of those witnesses is uh, witness 487. And I just wanted to clarify with counsel as to who who is the other witness uh, that he was referring to. Um, because I do we, we did propose yesterday that the court, uh, that we look at whether there are other witnesses uh, that the uh, Ingsuri uh, team would be uh, willing to waive his presence for. Um, so I wanted to uh, just clarify with counsel as to which was the second witness that he is unwilling to waive for. Auquel Maître Carnavas a fait référence et pour lequel Ingsuri ne renonce pas à sa participation directe au prétoire. To clarify matters, uh, Your Honours, uh, it was our understanding that the next witness was going to be 583, TCW 583. Thank you, Council, says the President. Le Président, je vous remercie. Now we received the initial information regarding the hearing of the opinion of the treating doctor. Nous allons donc maintenant commencer l'audience pour entendre l'opinion du médecin soignant.
the chamber will therefore decide to hold this hearing in public La based Chambre on the opinion publique. from the concerned parties. Court officer, could you invite the witness into the courtroom? Veuillez faire entrer le, doctor. le médecin dans le prétoire. President, good le morning, doctor. Bonjour, doctor. This morning, you are invited by the chamber Vous êtes invité to give ce matin your opinion in relation to the health condition of Yang Sari. Sur de santé de Yang Sari. Regarding his uh, hospitalization for the last couple of days and sur his being discharged. Hospitalité. Hospitalisation au cours des derniers jours. The chamber will consider your opinion in regards to the health condition of the accused, whether he is able to participate in the proceedings before this chamber. Peut participer aux audiences. Before we put some questions to you, we would like Avant to give you some instructions. First, please wait until you see the red light Quelque on the microphone before you speak. So then there is enough time for the interpreters to interpret your response. We use three languages in this courtroom. interpreters to interpret your response. We use three languages in this courtroom. J'aimerais ensuite vous poser des questions sur vos antécédents. What is your name, doctor? Comment vous appelez-vous? Response. Réponse. My name is Dr. Lim Sibuta. Je m'appelle le docteur Lim Sibuta. Thank you. Can you question. tell the chamber your date of birth? Pouvez-vous nous dire quand vous êtes né? Response. Réponse. I was born on the 15th of August 1966, and 1966. my place of birth is Kandal province. Question, where is your current address? Question, où habitez-vous? Response, Réponse. my current address is at is at number 41 at 336 in Pradamco. Question, are you related by blood or by law to the accused Ian Sari or to any of the civil parties? Response, no, I am not related to any of the parties to the proceeding. Aucun lien de parenté ou d'alliance avec les parties à la procédure. What is your religion? Question. Quelle est votre religion? Response. I follow Buddhism. Je suis bouddhiste. Question. As the greffier reported that you have taken an oath already. Le greffier a dit que vous avez prêté serment. Already before you entered this courtroom. Avez-vous prêté serment? Response. That is correct. Réponse. Oui, c'est exact. Question. Can you inform the chamber Question. regarding your education and professional career? Pouvez-vous nous parler de votre parcours académique et de votre expérience professionnelle? Réponse. Réponse. In 1987. I was an assistant doctor. In 1987, I was a medical adjunct at the Faculty of Medicine, and in 1998, I became a doctor in that faculty. I became a doctor in that faculty. 
and in 2003, I completed en 2003, my education. J'ai terminé mes études. At the same faculty of medicine. À la faculté de médecine. Receiving my diploma degree. Et j'ai reçu mon diplôme. In 2004, I completed my specialized skill in heart disease at en 2004, Versailles University in France, in Paris. À de Versailles à Paris en and cardiologie. currently, I am a doctor at the Khmer Soviet Friendship Hospital. Je pratique maintenant la médecine au, à l'hôpital de la médecine Khmer Soviétique. Question. How long have you been working at the emergency section at the Khmer Soviet Friendship Question. Hospital? Depuis combien de temps travaillez-vous au service des urgences de l'hôpital? I've been working in that hospital Réponse. at the emergency section since I completed uh, my medical study in 2004. Depuis la fin de mes Thank études you. de médecine en 2004. We will now have some questions Le for plaisir. you. Je vous remercie. Vous allez maintenant vous poser des questions from the Khmer Soviet Friendship Hospital, sur le rapport de l'hôpital, s'agit du document 301-MKS, un acte levé en français, envoyé à la Chambre de première instance. Court officer, Could you present this report to the doctor for his audience? Veuillez remettre le rapport en question au médecin. Hi, Nang. My chang ay kasa ni nilo ay krong tu tuh pong ay kasa i dot mui slah chat sap. Also, please press the document on screen. That is document E eleven slash seven zero slash two. À l'écran, il s'agit du document portant le code E onze bar soixante-dix bar deux. Doctor, the report in front of you is it your own report? Le rapport que vous avez devant vous. Response. Yes, it is. Celui que vous avez rédigé. Réponse. Oui. Question. Question. Did you yourself examine and treat Mr. Yang Sari? Examiné et traité en personne. When he was admitted to the hospital. Quand il a été admis à l'hôpital. From the 17 May to the 22nd May 2012. Response. I am one of the doctors who treated him. Je suis un des médecins qui l'ont traité. There were some of my colleagues and specialists who treated Mr. Yang Sari. Certains de mes collègues et des spécialistes ont eux aussi traité Yang Sari. Question: Before that, had you ever treated the medical condition of Mr. Yang Sari? Avez-vous déjà traité le response after I was transferred? From the Kalmet Hospital. Vous déjà traité Yang Sari. So rather after he was transferred to be treated from the Kalmet Hospital, I have been treating Mr. Yang Sari. Oui, je traite Yang Sari depuis son transfert de l'hôpital Kalmet. Thank you. Can you inform the chamber? The medical condition of Mr. Yang Sari during the time that he was sent from the ECC by the ECC doctor de on the 17 April and the subsequent treatments by you. Quand il a été envoyé à l'hôpital le 17 mai et les différents traitements qu'il a reçus et que vous lui avez prodigués. 
I'd like to uh, provide a brief réponse. detail on the morning of the 17th when he was sent by the doctor mai, from ECCC. At that time, he had l'hôpital. the symptom of uh, frequent coughing les symptômes suivants, and tout breathing difficulty and incessant, dizziness. After des difficultés respiratoires et des vertiges. He was uh, treated at the emergency section and we conducted a new diagnosis. Nous avons procédé à un nouveau diagnostic. It was related to his uh, bronchitis condition and after the diagnostic completion of the diagnosis, it did not have any impact on his existing heart disease. Et il a été he déterminé que ce n'avait pas d'incidence sur sa maladie cardiovasculaire existante. Il avait la grippe et une bronchite. Le premier jour de son hospitalisation, son état de santé s'est amélioré et son état de santé s'est amélioré encore plus au cours des prochains des jours qui ont suivi. Nous avons invité un médecin spécialiste qui travaille to ici diagnose his bronchitis condition. au CETC pour diagnostiquer son bronchite. The only serious condition of his hospitalization is a bronchitis. La pathologie and la plus sérieuse dont il souffrait, la treatment, bronchite. We held a meeting to consider whether he would be able to be discharged from the hospital. No. And Nous avons ensuite considéré s'il pouvait sortir de l'hôpital. Evaluation and the diagnosis condition and of his uh, improvement, then we decided to discharge him on the morning of the 22nd de of May 2012. Permis à Yang Seri de sortir de l'hôpital le matin du 22 mai 2012. However, due to the condition that he had been hospitalized for the uh, number of days and Mais due to his established heart condition une maladie cardiovasculaire à sa sortie de l'hôpital, we, our group, uh, that he have a brief nous avons of rest recommandé to his qu'il condition. ait quelques jours de repos pour améliorer son état de santé. And also the among all the and our we Lors we should also have a constant uh, monitor of his heart condition after the two-day period of rest by the ECCC doctor. Par le médecin des CETC de son état de santé pendant ces deux jours de repos. Due to his health condition, Nous avons aussi formulé la recommandation suivante that he should attend the si proceeding only in the court in the waiting room downstairs which is closer to the medical unit and it's easier for the doctor to monitor his health condition that is after the two days rest. Pour le de and faire le suivi de l'état de santé de We will monitor his health condition on a daily basis Nous and he will report to you accordingly. Yang Sari va se continuer et nous vous ferons des rapports fréquents so it means à cet égard. That you also Le Président, uh, the je vous remercie. Deten- the detention facility and the waiting room downstairs, downstairs, le which is linked centre de détention to the et la cellule de détention temporaire du tribunal, correct? muni de l'audiovisuel avec le plateau. Parce que vous avez dit, on peut en tirer this, uh, la conclusion que compound. vous... Vous êtes also familier with the avec les installations so au CTC et la cellule de détention temporaire du tribunal qui permet à l'accusé de suivre l'audience à distance. Maybe this has come to know a lot of knowledge upon the agreement for the treatment of the accused between the ECC and the Khmer Soviet Friendship Hospital. Ou Is that correct? L'avez-vous su plutôt dans le cadre de l'entente entre les CETC et l'hôpital. Amongst the, the doctors who has been uh, treating Dr. Ying Seri here at the ECC, un I am one of them. Je suis un so des médecins qui tra- a traité Ying Seri au CETC. À tous les I cinq jours, come and inspect je viens the, ici his health condition. pour so l'examiner. I am familiar with the waiting room downstairs je and connais the donc bien unit la, downstairs. l'unité médicale du tribunal et la cellule de détention temporaire. Question. 
According to your report, that is the last point. Question. That uh, the patient should take a two-day rest. Le dernier point de votre rapport est d'indiquer que sa sortie de l'hôpital ne peut se passer aura besoin du fait de son état actuel de deux jours de repos. Pouvez-vous nous expliquer ces deux jours Do we count the day today, the day from today? Est-ce que deux jours cela comprend aujourd'hui Est-ce que deux jours cela comprend aujourd'hui Est-ce que deux jours cela comprend aujourd'hui Il est sorti de l'hôpital hier. Can you enlighten us on this point Pouvez-vous préciser Response. The true Réponse. The rest period is to be counted from the day that he's discharged from the hospital that is jours, from today. C'est à partir d'aujourd'hui. Response. Here we would like him to participate Question. remotely for example for today and our tomorrow proceeding what would be the uh, condition pour les besoins de l'audience d'aujourd'hui de demain quelles seraient les conditions pour permettre à Yang Sari Response. de suivre l'audience à distance after he was discharged from Réponse. the hospital my group including the specialized doctor and the supervisor notre groupe, we decided uh, that he should have a two days rest after he lui fallait deux jours de repos discharge. suivant sa sortie de l'hôpital and one week after the two days resting he should be able to participate Et remotely to the trial proceeding before the devrait ECC. pouvoir suivre les audiences à distance pendant une semaine. Il est plus facile pour lui de suivre l'audience depuis la cellule d'intention temporaire, cellule qui est adjacente à la section médicale du tribunal. Autre juge, avez-vous des questions pour le médecin The defense team for Yang Sari, do you have any questions to Yingsari. be put des questions à poser au médecin? to this doctor? Uh, good morning, Mr. President. Good morning, Your Honors. I do have a few Maître questions. Uh, Bonjour. J'en ai fait uh, quelques questions à poser. Uh, I understand it, uh, that you're not a uh, psychiatrist or a psychologist. Is that correct? Je crois comprendre que vous n'êtes ni psychiatre ni psychologue. That's exact. Correct. Do you know uh, during the last few days uh, whether Mr. Inksri has Ce undergone jour, any uh, testing to see whether he's capable of following si the proceedings? Était en mesure de suivre l'audience et ce en le soumettant à certains tests dans le contexte de son état de santé actuel. Could I have the question again, please? Réponse. Peut-on répéter la question? Yes, uh, you indicated that you and the specialists vous avez dit que vous et les uh, have concluded that a minimum of two days rest would be required. Il fallait au moins deux jours my de question repos. is question whether donc la suivante. any specific testing was que done des tests ont été effectués to see uh, about Mr. Inksri's capacity pour, uh, to follow, la capacité to de concentrate, to comprehend, à se to participate à in proceedings of this nature. À suivre l'audience. Generally, before we réponse. came to the conclusion that he that he have to have a two-day rest, Avant de we did not decide que deux jours de repos étaient nécessaires. Ourselves, we discussed among our specialists. Nous who avons discuté entre at hospital, spécialistes and we come up with the recommendation that is a two-day rest. Et nous sommes arrivés à la recommandation now, when you say de deux jours de repos, could you please question, vous parlez tell de spécialistes. You know, what's, what are the specialties of these doctors Quelles sont les spécialités that are part of the team qui font along with you that are monitoring Mr. Inksri's health? 
surveille l'état de santé de M. Engsari. Réponse. Notre groupe comporte différents médecins qui se spécialisent dans différents domaines, y compris les questions cardiologiques et psychologiques. J'ai rencontré mon client ce matin. Il m'a dit que s'il essaie de se concentrer pendant quelques minutes, il est pris de vertige. D'après vous, est-ce que cela est inhabituel ou bien est-ce que c'est normal pour quelqu'un qui a son âge, qui a les problèmes cardiologiques et bronchitiques que l'on connaît On the basis of uh, his poor health condition, which does not allow him to stand for a long time, de par son état de santé, il ne peut pas rester longtemps debout. Il y a aussi eu des antécédents issues. cardiologiques et donc des problèmes de santé qui remontent à 1992. Even though he has stable heart condition. Son trouble cardiologique s'est stabilisé, certes, mais suite aux évaluations effectuées, nous avons constaté une détérioration de son état cardiologique. C'est la raison pour laquelle nous avons estimé qu'il ne devait pas comparaître dans le prétoire même, mais plutôt suivre l'audience depuis la cellule temporaire du sous-sol. Les différents spécialistes en ont discuté et nous avons posé notre diagnostic et nous avons considéré qu'il peut être stabilisé que l'on ne pouvait pas améliorer son état de santé, mais seulement le stabiliser et qu'il n'y avait qu'une détérioration possible. Question. Je répète ce que j'ai demandé. Mon client m'a dit qu'après quelques instants, lorsqu'il doit rester assis dans son état de santé actuel, il a tendance à être pris de vertige. Est-ce que c'est normal, compte tenu de son état de santé, compte tenu des troubles de santé qu'il connaît et compte tenu également de ses antécédents médicaux Oui, Feel dizzy because of his physical strength. But after our treatments and examination, we found that his present condition is not very different from his condition six months ago. Given his age, he is not very different from his condition six months ago. Given his age, he is not very different from his We cannot come up with a 100% Vu son âge, nous ne pouvons pas sure. tirer de conclusions absolument certaines. We need to him over a of nous devons time pouvoir that is le suivre durant une certaine période to him today, en continu. C'est pourquoi nous voulons pouvoir continuer à le suivre aujourd'hui et durant les jours qui viennent afin de voir change. si son état de santé va changer. Nous devons voir si après avoir souffert d'un flou et il a eu After he la grippe, has suffered from other conditions, whether he notamment, continues to suffer this. et il faudra so voir si ces problèmes to subsistent. Him at least over a pour ce faire, of one week. nous we devons to pouvoir his le suivre so de près pendant sure. au moins une semaine afin de parvenir uh, à une conclusion you, absolument certaine. Maître Canavas, merci. Docteur, je n'ai plus de questions. Uh, good. President, uh, thank you. Le Président, merci.
que l'accusation souhaite poser des questions aux médecins And that applies to uh, the lead co-lawyers as well. Whether you have any questions to put to this medical doctor? Thank you, Mr. President. I just have one question. Mr. President, just one question to pose to the doctor. Thank you, Mr. President. Uh, good Merci, morning, Doctor. Uh, the one question I just wanted to clarify is your recommendation uh, that Mr. Ingsbury have two days Vous avez to rest. Deux jours de repos. Um, does that mean two days in which he does not que cela participate veut dire que in the proceedings jours, ne peut even from his holding cell? Audience? Or did you mean two days in which he could participate from the holding cell? Or did you mean two days in which he could participate from the holding cell? That is the one that I just wanted to clarify for you. J'aimerais obtenir des précisions à ce sujet. Ben, ça me rappelle que the the two day rest. Réponse. Is for him to rest completely without participating in the proceedings. Not even sans remotely. aucune participation à l'audience, sous quelque forme que ce uh, soit, y compris much, à distance. That's, that's L'accusation. Merci, docteur. C'était la seule question que nous voulions poser. Uh, le président. President, la parole thank you. Yes, a national est à présent au avocat cambodgien pour les parties civiles. Uh, good morning, Mr. President. Good morning, your Bonjour, owners. Monsieur le Président, Mesdames, Messieurs les Juges. Uh, good morning, doctor. Bonjour, docteur. J'ai quelques questions you. à vous poser. Especially concerning the dizziness that Mr. Ian said he experienced. First of all, I would like to know that when Mr. Ian Sari was hospitalized, during which you had contact with him, did Mr. Ian Sari raise the issue of this dizziness with you personally or among your colleagues? Est-ce qu'il vous en a parlé personnellement ou bien est-ce qu'il en a parlé personnellement à vos collègues? Response. Réponse. This issue is also one of one among the other issues that we examined. That he experienced breathing difficulties and he begins to feel dizzy. Did you observe any signs of dizziness? Suite à ces problèmes respiratoires, le patient connaît des vertiges. Any factors that cause dizziness? Question. D'après vous, quels facteurs peuvent être à l'origine de ces vertiges? Response. After he was admitted to the hospital, we observed that the enzyme in his blood was also affected. We observed that the enzyme in his blood was also affected. We observed that the enzyme in his blood was also affected. We observed that the enzyme in his blood was also affected. We observed that the enzyme in his blood was also affected. We observed that the enzyme in his blood was also affected. We observed that the enzyme in his blood was also affected. We observed that the enzyme in his blood was also affected. We observed that the enzyme in his blood was also affected. We observed that the enzyme in his blood was also affected. We observed that the enzyme in his blood was also affected. De ces vertiges. For a normal person, it wouldn't be a problem. But for him who suffered from health condition, health matters. It is very difficult for him. It is very difficult for him. Du patient, ce facteur est une question. This is my last question. Question. Concerning question. This dizziness. Concerning ces vertiges. How long will he? Suffer from this dizziness. Durant combien de temps est-ce qu'ils vont se poursuivre? Response. Réponse. Given his health condition. Compte tenu de son état de santé. It depends entirely on his physical strength. Cela dépendra de. But we cannot come up with. Sa force. A 100% conclusion as to how long he will suffer from this. But if he is to sit for a long time, he will experience this dizziness. And if he is to sit for only a short time, it won't be a big problem for him. S'il reste assis longtemps, il sera certainement pris de vertige. S'il reste assis peu de temps, ça ne devrait pas être le cas. Il souffre d'une grippe et également de troubles cardiologiques. 
has a good health conditions. Donc, so de manière générale, son état de santé n'est pas bon. On peut donc penser que ses vertiges well. seront fréquents, compte tenu en plus de son âge. Question. Uh, thank you, doctor. Thank you, Mr. President. Maître Pican. Merci, docteur. Merci, Monsieur le Président. Le Président. Merci. Look, may we, Michael Canovas? Le président. Council Michael Canovas. Maître Canovas. Could you indicate against the pseudonyms of the witnesses that you said that your client were not aware of? Témoins à propos desquels, d'après vous, votre client ne renoncera pas à sa présence dans le prétoire. Amongst the witnesses that the chamber has already determined to be heard in the near future. Et ce, s'agissant des témoins uh, you, que la President. Chambre a décidé de faire cet apparaître dans un avenir proche. We understand there are approximately five witnesses that were listed uh, for the near future. Nous pensons savoir qu'il y a environ cinq témoins qu'il est prévu de citer à comparaître prochainement. Parmi ces cinq, il y en a deux, TCW487 et TCW583. Ce sont là les deux témoins en question. Bah, 
Thank you. Thank you, Doctor, for your valuable time to Merci, Docteur, be here bien and voulu give information la peine de venir des concerning the health conditions of the accused in Sari. Sari. That is whether he is able to participate in the courtroom la chambre tenait à vous entendre pour savoir During si Yelsari était en mesure de participer à l'audience jusqu'à la fin de la semaine. The information from you is now concluded and à présent, you can be accused. docteur, vous pouvez disposer. It is now appropriate for us to Take a break. We will Nous allons have a 30 minute break les débats so that the chamber can deliberate on pour une this issue to see whether we La need to move on en effet or we need to adjourn for de the day. S'il faut the lever l'audience pour aujourd'hui ou continuer. Suspension des débats.